What it is guys, my name is Swifters and today I'm going to be bringing you an absolutely outstanding glitch that allows you guys to insure and duplicate any vehicle in GTA 5 after the 1.12 patch update and give these vehicles to your friends. Now guys, all I ask is that before this video does get underway, you'd slap that like button and subscribe to my channel as I am trying to reach 25,000 subscribers and by subscribing and showing your support, it would really mean a lot. So let's get started. So guys, the first thing that you're going to want to do is get a vehicle that you would like to store inside of your garage. In this case, my friend's going to be allowing me to use this dink adjuster because I actually don't have one inside of my garage. So simply get inside of the vehicle that you'd like to store inside of your garage and take it over to your apartment. I know that this glitch does work with the 400k apartment, but I'm not too sure about any of the other ones. So simply park the vehicle exactly like you see me doing so. Two wheels on the street, two wheels on the curb. Once the vehicle is parked like that, simply walk inside of your garage. Once inside of your garage, pull up your interaction menu and scroll all the way down to your spawn location and make sure that your spawn location is set to your garage as opposed to last location. After you do that, scroll back up to your inventory and make sure that you add some changes to your character. This could be by adding some glasses or some hats, so simply put on any glasses or hat and after you do that, you're going to need to make sure that the game saves properly. You can confirm that the game does save by looking in the bottom right hand corner and seeing that an orange rotating circle does appear. So after the game saves, make your way over to a vehicle that you don't mind getting rid of. The vehicle outside of the garage that you're trying to get inside is going to be replacing this vehicle, so simply head over to a vehicle that you don't mind getting rid of, get inside of it, and from here, you're going to need to have your friend invite you to a job. So have your friend host a job, and once they invite you, simply accept the job invite and simultaneously drive outside of your garage. You know you did this correctly if you can hear the garage door open once you're in the sky cam. So as you guys can see, I'm inside of the lobby for the job from here. All you're going to want to do is back out as soon as it gives you the option to do so. And if you guys have done everything correctly from here, it should spawn you in this glitchy state inside of your garage. This is where it gets a little bit difficult. You're going to need to run over to your car as fast as you can. And if you guys have done everything correctly, you guys should now be able to get inside of the vehicle and it will put you in this glitchy state again. And if you guys do it correctly, it'll kick you out. And you guys should now have the Dink Adjuster or whatever vehicle that you're trying to duplicate outside on the street. And from there, you guys can now get inside of that vehicle and and take it inside of your garage. So as you guys can see, I now have the Dink Adjuster inside of my garage, so this is an extremely easy car duplication glitch in order to give cars to your friends and insure any vehicle and put it inside of your garage. So guys, that's all I really do have for you in this video, I hope you did enjoy it, and if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe for some of the best GTA 5 content. I do post the latest tips, tricks, glitches, news, and easter eggs found in GTA 5. I am currently working on finding an unlimited money glitch after the 1.12 patch update, so be sure to subscribe to my channel to stay tuned. Until next time guys, this has been Swifters. I'm out. Peace.